always wondered how it is to be alive thousands of years ago. Kashan is a magical city that exactly makes you feel like you're in a different time and offers much more than only the desert. There are a lot of traditional houses to explore where you can get lost and stroll around for hours. In my head I imagined how the people were living here hundreds of years ago, what kind of discussions they had and how they furnished their houses. These places will definitely play with your fantasy. And of course there's Kashan's historical mosque and the traditional bazaar, which offers you a perfect spot for an Iranian breakfast. If you ever wondered how the most beautiful historical garden of the Middle East looks like, then you shouldn't skip going to Finn Garden. It's a place to relax and not too far from the city. Although there are so many sites in Kashan that are impressive and just beautiful, I didn't see a lot of travelers and most of the time I was the only person visiting a site. It seems that the city is still quite undiscovered by tourists which makes it a great time to visit right now. On the other hand there is the Abiyani village which attracts more people due to its unique historical charm. This village is one of the oldest in Iran and has been called the window to Iranian history and people also say that it's a living museum. It's a really picturesque city and the locals seem like really cool people as well. Why would you go there? It's a very important and holy city for most Iranians, but not really known among travelers. To be honest, I didn't even know it by myself, but then I quickly realized that it's definitely worth a visit. Qom has a really great architecture and beautiful buildings. 